Is that how you gonna wear your skirt? Hey. Is that how you gonna wear your skirt? <laughs> and then this goes down. There we go. <laughs> Yep, he's eating bye bats. <laughs> you ready for daycare? You ready for daycare? You ready for daycare? Welcome back to my channel. I am looking at my Christmas tree. I finally got it up. I wanted to show you guys really quick. I got one of my Christmas trees up. Um, we done this one last night. Let me turn it on for you guys. I'm super excited. I love this tree. So this is our more formal tree. I went with the color scheme gold, red, and green. And then we have some of our favorite rustic ornaments on it. So... And then there's the elfie, which we did not do the elf on the shelf. I just really like that ornament for some reason. I think he's cute in there. Um, and then we got our ornament from Maine. And then just some few other ones. That's Aubrey's first Christmas ornament from Tennessee. I mean, we just have all of our like favorite ornaments on this tree. That's Aubrey's ornament for this year. It's gorgeous. And this is another one of our... Aubrey's ornaments for this year is this Minnie Mouse bale. Super cute. We got our little red truck. Another Green Bay Packers ornament, of course. And our star's a little crooked. We put it up there and then it fell crooked. So we definitely need to fix that. But that's our beautiful tree. Love it. And this is um, our bed skirt, or <laughs> tree skirt, is from target i got it last year on clearance it's um the magnolia line so i've already started putting a few things in the stockings um for the kids i don't fill up chad's until <laughs> christmas eve because he'll peek through it but the kids they don't know so i go ahead and put their stuff in there maverick's just got a little rudolph in here we found that at walmart yesterday and he absolutely loved it so i got that for him and then he's also got some shoes in there um, but I will be doing a stocking gift guide, uh, $5 and under stocking gift guide, basically. <laughs> um, showing you what all I put in the kids' stockings for them every Christmas. And then I might do one for my husband, Chad, but I don't know yet. Then some more decorations over here, which the camera's not picking up very well, but I just got a little white quilt blanket up there and it's so pretty we also have our christmas tree that's in the front living room because it's for our um tacky sweater what is that called <clears throat> the ugly sweater party yeah <laughs> so i made it very tacky and colorful and crazy it's it's obnoxiously crazy i think i don't really care for colorful lights and stuff but on that tree i did because we're having a big party and it's supposed to be as tacky as possible so i went with that I'm still not done decorating. I got a lot I got to do today, like decorate our little um, stair, not stairs, the stair lip. I don't know what it's called, but I'll show you guys later. <clears throat> but I need to put the tree and presents up there to decorate that little area because it's right when you walk in the house. So I definitely want to make that look good. But I'm currently making Chad's breakfast. Well, girls, I would say it was successful. We got three different options for our pictures tomorrow. A sneak peek of what some Christmas gifts are going to be this year. All my girlfriends out there, you know, here's a little hint of what you might be getting. <laughs> Good morning, buddy. We got lots of laundry to put up today. Yeah. We got a lot of laundry to put up. Did you sleep good? <laughs> I 
<laughs> what are you doing? It's time. We had to put the baby gate up. Because Maverick fits perfectly right under the edge of the tree. So he just jerks down all the bottom ornaments. Which isn't a big deal because all of them are... I made sure to put the... Um, plastic ornaments at the bottom the ones that he can't break are all along the bottom and then my very expensive um, breakable ones are towards the top but yeah it's getting annoying picking up a hundred ornaments and these ornaments that he's chewing on now that he's playing with go to his little tree over there um, and normally the tree keeps him very distracted but right now he's in his walker because he was eating his breakfast um, and I'm trying to get him to start walking so I've been putting him in his walker more and he can't get to his tree so he gets goes to that tree so I just pulled out their baby gate um, the only time we ever use this baby gate is for Christmas um, we used it last year to block in because I'll put all the presents under here and it keeps Aubrey from and now Maverick from smishing all the presents and jerking off all the ornaments <laughs> Now we're in Aubrey's room. I got Maverick here. He's gonna eat some goldfish. And we're gonna work on this big pile of kid laundry. So this is all the kids laundry. Um, this is about two loads worth of kids laundry. So we're gonna go ahead and separate Maverick's and Aubrey's and then put all that away. And I also need to go through all these drawers. As you see, there's pants sticking out there. And go through Aubrey's pants and fold them and organize them a little bit better because I've just been throwing them in the drawer. Yesterday we went through all the clothes and got rid of the clothes that um, they're too big for now. So uh, I have plenty of hangers now. <laughs> Blue and green. So that's how it's gonna look apart. Just makes their closet look a little bit more organized. Then I've told lies. I can only hope that Santa Claus and my records agree. Then maybe this year Santa's coming home to me. detail it today I uh, brought my cleaner stuff because I detail it myself honestly because I'm too I, I don't like sitting at a um, detailing place and waiting for them to detail my car especially with I have Maverick and stuff when if I do it myself here at wiki wiki where they have free vacuum and stuff um, I just bring my spray bottle and cleaners and stuff and can do it with Maverick still in the car um, or with the kids still in the car, but today I just have Maverick. So I'll just save a few dollars and save some trouble and just do it myself. But we're also going to hit up Target um, Dollar Spot to try to find some stuff for the kids' stocking so I can do my $5 stocking video for you guys, $5 and under stocking video for you guys. Um, I'm just going to take you with me, but the people are coming over here, so I'll see you guys in a minute. Thank <laughs> you. 
extremely long time. I feel like I have my together, or my, sorry, my together. Um, I just went to Target. I got my car detailed. Um, got a few of the gifts for the for the kids' stockings, and I also got one of Chad's gifts that I think he's absolutely gonna love. But it's something he also needs, so that's good. Um, and then I also got a couple ideas for a few more gifts for him, but they're pretty, pro they're little, they're like this big, but extremely expensive. So, <laughs> just got the wait. I might go get them in a couple weeks, but yes, I feel like I got my SHIT together today. Like, I've been cleaning all morning. I woke up at 5.30 and just been clean. Sorry, this, these hairs are bothering the crap out of me. But, so I woke up at 5.30 this morning and just cleaned like you wouldn't believe. I got my dishes done. I got my kitchen clean. My floors are clean. We got the baby gate up around um, the Christmas tree. I got the stairway decorated completely um, and lit up, which that, that was a task that I did not film because... It was very difficult. <laughs> it was extremely difficult. But I think I've already showed you a little clip of that. I might have, but I think Maverick was crying in the background, so I'm not really sure if I'm gonna use it. But you'll see it in the um, Christmas decor house tour anyway, so don't worry about it. Um, what else have I done? I've got a lot of laundry done. It's still not done. I think I have about one more load to wash and then have to put everything up. I finished putting up all the kids' laundry. Y'all saw that earlier. But I have not finished putting up mine and Chad's laundry yet. So, I've actually been putting it out for a while. I've, we've just been living out of the clean hamper for a while, which is really sad. Um, but I'm actually going to get all that done. And that'd be good. If I, can get out, if I can get all that done, if I can get all the laundry caught up with today and put up and start getting our bedroom cleaned up, I'll be one happy person. But... So I just got a lot of stuff knocked out today and I'm really, really happy. And just leaving Target, I had my reusable bags. Um, I didn't get plastic bags, which I know is not a big deal and I 99% of the time I do. But I always have these reusable bags that I'm like, I want to use these. I want them to be more of a, you know, environmental, do something, you know, make myself feel good somehow about the environment so i was able to use my bags and got everything i needed to do didn't spend too much sorry somebody just hit something over here um and i'm just i'm just feeling good about myself I and mean, it's been a while since i've felt this good and this productive so i think i'm out of the swamps if y'all don't know i was sick and like our whole family was sick for about two weeks, but then we've also been dealing with all that marriage, marriage stuff for the past two months. Um, so I've just been so negative and down and really depressed. And I feel like today I got a new, I, like wipes my slate clean basically. You know, I put out all my Christmas decorations. It feels like a new start, I guess. I know it's, I know it's probably dumb and you're like, oh my goodness, she's just, she's crazy, but it's just how I'm feeling right now. So now we are pulling up to Dollar Tree. And I'm going to see what all I can find here for the kids stocking and for Chad stocking. Um, so that way I can get this video filmed for you probably tomorrow while Maverick's taking a nap. And get it up for y'all. So I'll see you guys in a minute. If you need makeup organization containers, Dollar Tree has them. Ugh, this room is a disaster. So I'm trying to get everything put up. I mean, I've pretty much got all the laundry done. It's all spread out right now, but I'm just working on putting it all up. And then I'm going to focus on trying just to get this room picked up. Um, why the camera won't focus. But this is all, well, not the blanket on top, but... Chad just got back from Florida. I'm um, working in Florida for a few weeks, so that's his suitcase. I still need to unpack it because he basically just lives out of his suitcase all the time. But I want to unpack that because it's just annoying it being right here in the floor. And then I just got to clean up, as you can see. All this just needs to be put up.
Okay, so I still need a vacuum, but I'm done now. So I can still need to vacuum up that stuff. Um, I did leave the suitcase there just because we are about to go on a trip and I need it out. So I'm just going to leave it there. I'm going to start packing probably tomorrow. Um, this is the kids area. I've showed this in plenty of videos before, my cleaning videos, but that's the kids' toys and some books. So when they're in here playing... Um, I stuck all of Chad's electronics underneath there because he had him just, like, he had his laptop upside down laying in the floor underneath the, um, hamper. So, um, to keep him from breaking, I stuck him underneath there on top of an extra blanket, a fuzzy blanket. Put his stuff up there there. Um, kind of made the bed. We used two different blankets. Like, he just sleeps with a sheet and I sleep with a fuzzy thick blanket. And then we have this blanket that if he starts getting cold, he uses. So I just tried to do something with that. Have the same setup as always. Just a picture and candles and remotes. The trash can. Um, picked up over here a little bit. I always have my cameras next to me because I edit at night. So at the end of the day, my laptop will be set up there and everything as well. Have my yoga mat because I stretch every morning. And I also put a new... Um, what is it called? Night light there. Because I'm tired of tripping on stuff at night. <laughs> and then I also stuck one in there uh, where the mirror is. I don't know if you can see it, but I stuck one there as well. So now I'm going to go upstairs and get Maverick. So I got some water here and some mixed vegetables. And I had some ham. Was it good? Was it good? No, no, no. <laughs> He's been really fussy today. Yeah. Does your ear hurt? You got another ear infection? Chicken and avocado eggs, toast and cheese. And Chad. So <laughs> you're so weird. Maverick started there playing. Aubrey's fussing like always. Earthquake test. <laughs> Earthquake test. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you're gonna be Okay guys, it's about 9 o'clock now, so we are about to head to bed. I put my new onesie on from Walmart. I think it was about $20. It's probably the best $20 I've ever spent on pajamas. I absolutely love them. I love this like fuzzy hood thing. I feel like an Eskimo. I just love it. It's so comfortable. Um, definitely worth the $20. And these little pom-poms are so cute can't beat that so we we're about to head to bed i went to the gym and got a massage done like the hydro massage thing for about 10 minutes so that was nice um uh, my back's been killing me lately <sighs> i don't know it's terrible I'm about to take a tylenol probably but i'm also drinking a glass of wine so i probably shouldn't do that but i'm about to just lay down in bed and edit a video for you guys that's going to go up tomorrow so I'll definitely link that video down below so you can go check it out. But I'm going to go work on that video and just relax for a little while and go to bed. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.